sermon, you know how you can see how these go, faggot. Or truly hurting inside. Do y'all hear me? They hurt. But they take that within themselves when they become reprobate, then it no longer matters to them. And they are making a big push to make sure that the have not don't have shit. They are making sure, and it's us that's got to be the ones that's going to tell the truth. I don't give a damn how you feel about my speech this morning. You better listen to my damn words because I'm telling your ass the truth about where you need to be. Alright, Pastor Corey here. We back again here in video two, uh, video C. And uh, I told you we was kicking OIM off. We still uh, here in 21. Uh, wanted to keep the videos short. Some of them, you know, uh, at most at length, we'll probably string out to 30 minutes. But I want to keep some short videos because we want to keep you involved. So we're going to finish reading here in 2nd Baruch chapter 21 because we are really feeding uh, the sheep this morning. Uh wanted to bring Josh in this morning to do some reading. This is Brother Josh uh, here with uh, Yah's Army getting it done here on the home front, man. We just are uh, blessed to have our young men, our young Hebrew brothers uh, and sisters already take hold of what we're doing here with the heritage. I'm telling you, it's, it's men like Pastor Charles Dow Jr. You know, it's, it's men like you see the elders here in the ministry. You see the pastor, pastors, mm -hmm. deacons, and the heads of assemblies, the heads of houses who we are charged to help generations be raised up in the Most High Yah. So we ain't doing this wicked shit that y'all doing. Y'all can forget it. And so, uh, this ain't church, so I can tell you right now, you're going to hear languages, you're going to hear uh, explicatives, you're going to hear things that you wouldn't normally hear Sunday morning with T.D. Jakes and the other people. But guess what? We are living the heritage of the Most High Yah. Mm -hmm. And ain't nowhere in the Bible that calls the words that the Gentiles have made up cursing. Nope. Nope. All right? They, they told you, they tell you everything that you should do, and they tell you everything that's good and bad, and you ain't even look behind it to see if it is so. But yet, you have not found in the word of Yah those things which shall bring you into eternal life. Mm -hmm. And uh, that's your fault, because uh, you have not knocked, and so the door wasn't open. You have not sought, so you have not found. You have not asked, so you have not Received. And so therefore here in the household of faith, among the Israelites, among those who are truly seeking, we have sought out and we have found the true and living Elohim of Abraham, Isaac, and Jacob. So here, let it be. We're going to finish in chapter 21. We're going to start uh, back at verse 13 and we're going to continue reading. Go ahead, Josh, read. 
For if there were this life only, which belongs to all men, nothing could be more bitter than this. You hear this? Wait a minute. Do you hear what he said? Yes, Pastor. This life, nothing could be more bitter than what? Than this. Y'all hear this? Why? That, but see what I said in video A, when I first started talking to y'all here in this second video of OIM here in the sequel. We, we kicking this thing off. All right. But he said, nothing can be more bitter. Well, I told you, you, you have not experienced it. You have not gone out there. You don't even know what the bitterness of this life is. But I do know all the vexation that's going on when I got to go out there and work, when you got to go stand in line, when you got to go out there and listen to people, when you got to look and pass through the inner city and see how sad our people look, how, you know, without just necessity. Mm -hmm. And they continue to add and add and add and stack upon. And this is what the, the time that we're living in, in this great increase for the Gentiles is that they are storing up so much in this earth right now and they are making a big push to make sure that the have not don't have shit. Yep. Come on, Pastor. They are making sure and it's us that's got to be the ones that's going to tell the truth. I don't give a damn how you feel about my speech this morning. You better listen to my damn words because I'm telling your ass the truth about where you need to be. Because if you ain't understand, see, this is for us. Only the true children of the Most High Y'all can understand how vexed we done been living in this earth. Mm -hmm. Y'all hear what I'm telling y'all this damn morning? Come on, Josh, finish read. For of what profit is strength that turns to sickness or fullness of food that turns to famine? Or beauty that turns to ugliness. For the nature of man is always changeable. For what we were formerly now, we no longer are. And what we now are, we shall not afterwards remain. For if a, consum a consummation had not been prepared for all, in vain would have been their beginning. Y'all hear this? If a confirmation is a consummation... If a consummation, mm. so a consummation means that you're going to bring it into what it should be, mm -hmm. or you're going to bring it into yourself. See, what happens when a man marries a wife? They enter into the consummation. Mm -hmm. So you no longer will be Jaden Teamer at the consummation. You will be Jaden whatever, or Jordan whatever. Not so with Demory. Demory is always going to remain in my house. He's going to be Demory Phillips until the day that he's done. Yep. So who you were, you will no longer be. You will be under him. You understand? Yes, sir. Come on. But regarding everything, that comes from you. Do inform me. And regarding everything about which I ask you. Do enlighten me. How long will that which is corruptible remain? And how long will time of mortals be prospered? And until what time will those who transgress in the world. Be polluted with much wickedness. Command wait, wait a minute. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. This is a righteous man. He was around during the time of Baruch. He talking about this, and this is a concern that concerns how long will the earth be filled with corrupt yeah. people and corruption and things that make life bitter. See, we read about Jeremiah and Baruch on Sabbath mm -hmm. during that message, the end foretold to the generations of Yah. Mm -hmm. I said and I said I was going to talk about it in OIM this week. Well, guess what? Here it is. Yeah. My spirit, I laid down. I laid down last night. And this was just oozing in my spirit. Just, I mean, just on me. I, could, I, I laid down. And it's, it's just, I felt it. I felt it right here. Son, get up and bring forth. Woo! I said, okay. 
I'm going to get up and bring forth. Hallelujah. See, you ain't got a plan. Guess what? Josh, get your ass over here this morning when you walked in mm-hmm. and let's, let's keep rolling. Hallelujah. Y'all hear me? Mm-hmm. This ain't no, you ain't got it. Look, we're here. Look, 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 look. We ain't got to set up the set. Let's just go and bring forth. Yeah. The word is going to go forth and accomplish. Whoever's supposed to hear this is going to hear it. Yep. Whoever's going to reject it is supposed to reject it. See, all of this, when you hear Baruch, what it is, it's going uh, to be. That's why I ain't worried about it. This ain't whether you like me or not, whether you care about me, whether you share this video, whether you share this channel. This ain't about you. This is about who is going to hear. Mm-hmm. Come on, guys. This is about the hearers and the doers. This ain't about no fake damn church Religion, gone, suit putting on, penguin shoes. This ain't about none of that. Mm-hmm. Y'all hear me? Yes, Pastor. Come on. Command, therefore, in mercy, and accomplish all that you said you would bring, that your might may be made known to those who think that your long suffering is weakness. You hear this? He said, make it known to them who think your long suffering is weakness. Mm. This is why this world is going like this. You think, that I had a man tell me, there's no up there. There's no one there. It's you. What? Wait a minute. See, they, know, they don't even know that there is a yacht. Right. You can't be as one of them that don't know that there is a yacht who heaven is his throne and earth. On, is his footstool. You can't be as one of them. Mm-hmm. Come on. And show to those who know not that everything that has befallen us in our city until now has been according to the long suffering of your power. Woo! Come on. See, everything's been according. See, it's just like it, it's like I already have a plan, Demore. Gabe, we already got a plan. I know what I want y'all to turn out like. But the more you allow, if you go sneak on YouTube and go look at videos, and then you look at all these people running around making these videos, hey, here you pew, 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 pew. I mean, all this, they ain't got no substance to it. Then in your head, that's how you think things should be because it, it is pleasing to your flesh. The more you find things pleasing to your flesh, the more you might find is not even good for you. That's it. That it is designed to lead you astray, mm-hmm. away from the Most High God. Yep. See, I learned that. It wasn't desirable when I started having things taken away from me to serve Yah, to put away the things that I wanted to do in life and set, set aside the things that felt good to me. But the more I died, that's what Paul talked about, mm-hmm. the more you became alive. Yep. Yep. So before you even get built up with all of this stuff, don't even let it make you become alive in foolishness and vainness and, and, and only become alive because of your spirit yes. starts to take a likening to that which the Most High want to raise you up in. That's why he said train the children up in the way that they should go. Mm-hmm. Do y'all hear me? Do y'all? Yes, sir. Alright, come on. Because on account of your name, you have called us a beloved people. Bring to an end, therefore, hereafter, mortality. And reprove accordingly the angel of death. And let your glory appear. And let the might of your beauty be known. And let Sheol be sealed. So that from now on it may not receive the dead. And let the treasuries of souls restore those which are enclosed in them. For there have been many years like those that are desolate from the days of Abraham and Yitzhak and Yaakov. And of all those who are like them, who sleep in the earth, on whose account you did say that you had created the world. You hear this? Mm-hmm. He said, on, you, on their account, you did create the world. So the world, see, that, see that's what I'm trying to get. 
When he said, Yah so loved the world, we ain't, really, we ain't thinking like this. That he gave his only begotten son, because now you like, he loved all of these wicked damn people that's out here that's trying to poison the food. He loved all these damn people that are destroying the earth. He loved all these damn people that is constructing a virus vaccine that's going to destroy the hell out of humanity. He loved all these people. No, he don't. Y'all said he hates sin mm -hmm. and he hates sinners. That's right. Did, he did. did, mm -hmm. did you better find it. Look, look that up and see if that's in the Bible. Look, look it up and see if God hates sinners. Look it up and see if he hates sin. And, and you leave that with you. Don't say I took it out of context because I only told you to look it up. So I'm going past it. You you, you look it up. Mm -hmm. Come on. And now, quickly show your glory and do not defer what has been promised by you. And when I completed the words of this prayer, I was greatly weakened. Y'all hear that? Mm -hmm. He said one thing in that last segment he said destroy uh, I want to say mortality. Yeah, mortality he said destroy mortality that means destroy death see that's the that's what the end goal of all of this is that w would it be good to not have to die would it mm -hmm. would it who is excited to die? Raise your hand. See, no, nobody raised their damn hand. But that's what you obtain because Yah is bringing you back to that. Yes. He got to get rid of sin because guess what? What happens is, and it proves it. How many times do I tell just y'all something, something more, more than once? See, see, you can't know you can't even answer. That's why I throw, listen, I throw niggas into the wall. I already had fixed a wall up here. I would dash you. True. We spare the rod. Spare the child. So if, if that's your philosophy, you can get your ass on too. <clears throat> uh, yeah, I said it. Pass the court. All right, let's read. We're going to start chapter 22. We're going over on to chapter 25 and maybe 26 and uh, we'll be done All right hey matter of fact let us read those chapters when we come back uh, like I said I'm gonna keep breaking these videos up in segments and uh, bless y'all Shalom Shalom me and brother Josh will be right back <music>